everyone. Happy Thursday the 15th. There's nothing to celebrate. Yesterday was Valentine. Nothing to celebrate today. But we're going to celebrate the filling of this break right here, though, on the 15th. Illusions 10. Pick your team 10. This is our last break of Illusions football. Your eyes are not deceiving you. This is not an illusion. This is the last break. I know. We're sad. I'm sad. We're giving, a little way, uh, giving away a little bit of break credit for that. Originally, it was just 25 bucks, but then we filled it so quickly. Added a little, a little smidge of break credit on top of that in honor of break number 10 right here. Now you're wishing we got to break 100, right? Um, here we go. <laughs> Let's pop this open so you know that was so you know it's from the same master case. Kind of a quiet day today, but hey, it's all good because we've got plenty of breaks to do tomorrow. Select football comes out tomorrow, which is why I'm glad we knocked out this last break of illusions, kind of clean up the site a little bit. Um, I think it's been a little bit since we've done illusions, so here's just as a reminder: five cards per pack, ten packs per box, uh, two autographs, two memorabilia cards plus one autograph memorabilia card per box on average. Good luck, everyone. Oh, right. I don't know why I keep forgetting that this, that this is in here. All right, good luck, everybody. Um, has there been any big football news lately? It's, a, it's We're in the off season, so not much is happening. Where does everyone think... Actually, this is a good article right here from NFL.com uh, about free agency. Free agency fits right there. So we can talk a little bit about this as we break. I don't need that video to auto start NFL.com. Thank you. Uh, well, the big name is Kirk Cousins. We were talking about that a little bit before we started the recording on this. Kirk Cousins, NFL.com suggesting potential fits or at least this author, whoever this person is. Um, Gil Brandt, Kirk Cousins, potential fits, Browns, Jets, and Broncos. What seems the most likely from between the Browns, Jets, and Broncos? Browns should. Tyrone, you want me to save the toppers or the bottomers until the end? Sure. I'll do it. Why not? I, I, I kind of like the underdog, you know. Go go! I, I wish he would go to the Browns. You know, I wish Kirk Cousins would be like, he's going to go wherever the money is, right, whoever pays him the most. But I almost want to I almost want to see Kirk Cousins go, you know what, I'm going to bring glory to Cleveland. I'd like to see him say that. All right, Juju Smith-Schuster is our first hit, first impressions. 17 out of 100. That goes to the Steelers. Scott V with the Steelers. Seal Curtain says Denver. He says Broncos. Arthur says Cardinals. That would actually be a good fit, too. I mean, truth is, a lot of teams could use, you know, could use a Kirk Cousins. Rookie endorsements, Tariq Cohen, 8 out of 25. Right, there you go. Yeah, Arthur saying Fitzgerald, Larry Fitzgerald signed for one more year and he wouldn't come back if they weren't going to make a good push for a quarterback. This is true. And we'll do left-right randomizers on this. Right here, I'll set this over here to remind me. Sam saying Jets have the cap space, though. Yeah, Jets could use a QB. First impressions, Jeremy McNichols going out to Rick and the Buccaneers. You know, Jets are not a I, Jets are not a bad choice either. I think Jets played a lot uh, a lot better football than people expected last year. I think a lot of that credit goes to the the coach, Coach Bowles. Um, but if they add a if they had a quarterback there. Some, a quarterback they know will be around for a while. That could be, that could be a pretty good. Uh, that could be it to turn that team, turn that team around. 
Tim Williams autograph for Andy and the Ravens. There you go, Andy. There's these guys too, the Vikings quarterbacks. David Yoku for the Browns. And we'll save these, collect all those till the end. All right, that was box one. Um, as uh, as Michael, as Steel Kurt suggested, I do not want to see Kirk Cousins in Denver. As a Raider fan, as a big Raiders fan, that's the last place I want to see Kirk Cousins go. Do not want him in the division. But Broncos will push hard for Kirk Cousins. I mean, I think they, I think they feel like they have a bit of a window. They've got offensive pieces there, and I think they feel like they have a window that's somewhat closing. You know what I mean? Those defenders are getting a little bit older. Those wide receivers are getting a little bit older. You know, they want to make one, one, uh, one big push. You know, Elway's, yeah, Elway's at the helm. He likes Kirk Cousins. I think they're going to make a big push for him because they, you know, they, they, they've screwed around with, with, uh, you know, with, with Trevor Simeon, Paxton Lynch, the Brock Lobster. I think they're tired of, you know, screwing around. <laughs> they're just like, let's just get somebody. <laughs> These guys didn't work out. Let's just get, let's just get someone who's already established. And a lot of options out there too. I mean, yeah, they, they got, they got to throw this guy. Return of the Mac. First impressions, Matt Collins, 54 out of 100 for the Eagles. William L. with the fly, Eagles fly. We got first impressions, Relic, C-Mac, Run CMC, Christian McCaffrey. That goes to Mark Glassman and the Panthers. Cat team, Mojo. And we got first impressions, relic, and autograph for the turtle. 22 out of 50. I'll give it two color CO. Right? There's a little bit of gold peeking out of there. Two color patch and autograph out of 50. 22 out of 50. Goes to Andrew and the Redskins. And he'll have Alex Smith now. Why didn't the why did the Redskins just give Kirk Cousins the money? That, that's something. I mean, maybe that's the stupid question. They're like, Joe, you're you're asking the, the Redskins to make sense. Jake Butt, 22 out of 25. Jake Butt. You know what's coming. He's a tight end, Karen. Karen with the Oppo Joe Mojo Broncos. Okay, Dan Daniel... Uh, Oh, you're welcome, Andrew. Uh, Daniel Anderson has a crazy thought. Brown signed Cousins, then trade their number one pick to Denver in a Ricky Williams-style trade. Any guesses on that redemption? That's crazy talk, Daniel Anderson. <laughs> All right, the redemption is... Mirror... Dual signatures. It's Brandon Cooks and Troy Brown. Both for the Patriots and Karen. There you go, Karen. Next box. Next box. Next free agent, according to. Uh, well, this is good. Now that we have Steel Curtain, Michael Gulucci back in the room after the Penguins game, um, where his Penguins beat my uh, Penguins beat my Kings. Oh, hey, happy birthday, Karen! If it is your real birthday, I'm always skeptical. You never know, Karen. I don't know. Not that you have any incentive to lie to me, but or get fake birthday mojo. But happy birthday to Karen and to Sam Roll and whoever else is out there with a birthday. You're welcome, Karen. Thanks for buying in. Uh, Le'Veon Bell, Steel Curtain. What's going on? 
Give, give us the give us the inside scoop from Pittsburgh. All right, I'll I'll believe you, Karen. I I had to I had to just I had to believe Sam Roll. I'll believe you too. No, happy birthday, you guys. Um, so Steel Curtain, give us the scoop. He's our he's our insider, our Pittsburgh Steelers insider, Steel Curtain. What happens? He says we'll sign him to a long deal, long term deal. Leaving aside, this is going to FL.com, leaving aside Bell's suspension history and a relationship from, with his team that can seem bumpy at times, Bell is, from a pure talent standpoint, an all-around back um, who, can care, who can make any squad better regardless of scheme. Blah, 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 blah. All right. So, Steel Current says long-term deal. What are the, what are, uh, what are the cap issues? I, someone was saying that, that the Steelers don't have the cap space to sign him. Or at least sign him to what he wants. John Ross, the third, first impressions autograph going to the Bengals. Tyrone, you got to learn me on that cap situation. Seal curtain. What's what's the what's going on with the money? I think I think Cousins has an autograph in here somewhere. Yeah, you have been pretty lucky with those Kirk Cousins. We got rookie endorsements out of one fifty. John o. Smith. 86 out of 150 for the Titans. That'll go to the DVD. Because I thought I heard that the, the Steelers, like the, like the hurdle was the cap, was some sort of cap issue. Uh, that was in the way of re-signing Le'Veon Bell. Wow, 21 out of 25, Dalvin Cook, two color patch and autograph. For the Vikings, Joe Falcone with that one. Nice one, Joe. Very nice hit. Dalvin Cook should be back healthy, hopefully. It'll be good, good for the Vikings, good for the hobby. Although, look at all the games they won without Dalvin Cook. We got Charles Harris for the Dolphins. It's 32 out of 50 for the Dolphinos. That'll be for Curtis Erickson with the Dolphins. All right, so Steel Curtain is saying, ah, they just re reworked two contracts to free up cap room and reduce the yearly salary of two other guys and gave them big signing bonuses to sign up to free up cap room. So they're serious. They're they're preparing for for that. All right. There's Dak Prescott. Spotlight memorabilia for the Cowboys. That'll be for Ryan Redman. Uh, NFL.com was saying Steelers. And then their other possibilities were Tampa Bay Buccaneers, New York Giants. Bucks? Maybe. I see the I see the Giants trying to you know, trying to make a make a splash there and try to chase after Le'Veon Bell. I always thought that the the Raiders should should chase him, but I but it's just it's need wise it's not necessarily at the top of our priority list. It's just too much to do. Um, Allen Robinson, Steel Curtain saying that Bell will have a long term deal within a month. Fair enough. Yeah, that seems most likely. Uh, some of the box toppers can be autoed, Andrew. Allen Robinson, wide receiver. NFL.com suggesting Jacksonville Jaguars, Dallas Cowboys, or Chicago Bears. What about the Raiders? He'll probably end up back in Jacksonville, right? But Cowboys could use a guy like him. Bears could use a guy like him. He's a pretty solid receiver. And he should stay with the Jaguars. I think, I think that's a good spot for him. They know how to use him. They know how to play him. Here's a randomizer. Von Miller, Khalil Mack, Joey Bosa. Yes, all three of these pass rushers are in the AFC West. It's pretty amazing, right? Some great players there. Some great defenders there. We 
We got Kenny G, first impressions autograph. That sacks he hit going to Matthew Long and the Lions. We're just talking about Le'Veon Bell. There he is. Taco Charlton, 95 out of 150 for the Cowboys. That'll go out to Ryan Redmond. There's Big Ben. Steel Curtain, how long does how long does Big Ben have in his career? That window is closing. I mean, that's maybe that's why you you signed Le'Veon Bell to a long-term contract. You got to start finding a quarterback, maybe. Rookie endorsements for the Oakland Raiders. Elijah Hood, 150 out of 150. 146 out of 150 for my Raiders. Uh, Johnny Gonzalez with that one. There you go, Johnny. And there's the Saxy autograph. Jersey and auto, Detroit Lions. That goes to Matthew Long. Seal Kearns says two more seasons for Big Ben. So what are you guys going to, I mean... I'm assuming maybe you try to look for a quarterback in late rounds, perhaps the, perhaps this year maybe four, fourth or fifth round kind of thing. See if you can find a find a Dak Prescott pop out of there. All right. Um, I'm going to skip some of the defensive players that the NFL.com has here. I think most people are more familiar with the offensive players. Late round this year is the steel curtain. That kind of makes sense. Um, what about Case Keenum? Where does Case Keenum go? Case Keenum, potential fits. Arizona Cardinals, Minnesota Vikings. Oh, you just you just made a bunch of R. Joshua Dobbs owners really sad, Seal Curtain. I would root for that guy. Hobby for just for the hobby's sake. Um Case Keenum. I mean, all these quarterbacks are almost interchangeable, you know. If like one guy gets here, one guy doesn't get go there, then he ends up here or there. Uh Daniel Lanch say he stays with the Vikings. I could see that. I could see them doing Case Keenum and Teddy Bridgewater, you know, and then, you know, them doing Case Keenum and uh, Teddy Bridgewater, and then letting letting Sam Bradford walk. There's D.D. Westbrook, three out of fifty. Nice patch, nice auto, great patch actually. Mark Glassman with that one. First impressions, Joe Williams. Yeah, Justin wants a uh, Vertex football. I'm sure we can do that tonight. Wait, didn't you just pick up a team, Mickey? Joe Williams goes to the Niners for Lee Cheeseman. Shelton Gibson, 89 out of 100 for your Super Bowl champions. Eagles, that goes to William L. with the fly, Eagles fly. Oh, so you, th you think they're just going to let Brad both Bradford and Bridgewater to walk. I see. That would be interesting. So all, all in on Case Keenum. Wow. Is that out of that's gotta be out of five. There it is. Four out of five for these three. Troy Aikman, Joe Namath, and Kurt Warner. That's a randomizer. That's a train whistle to end this break at the very end. So Troy Aikman. That'll be Ryan Redmond with the Cowboys, who has the Jets. Michael Gallucci with the Jets at Steel Curtain. And Kurt Warner Rams, that goes to Vic. 
All right, so one heart will be made, two hearts will be broken. Stay tuned for that at the end of the break. And wow, dual autograph, 7 out of 10, Cooper Cup, Josh Reynolds. That goes to Vic. So maybe I won't feel so bad if Vic doesn't win that randomizer. There you go, Vic. Nice dual auto, Cooper Cup, Josh Reynolds. People like the Cooper Cup out here. I think he's going to be pretty great, actually. If the, if the Rams keep doing what they're doing, and Josh Reynolds, too. All right, nice box. Next box, good luck everyone. Um, Sammy Watkins. Sammy Watkins is a free agent. Potential fits, Tennessee Titans, Oakland Raiders, and back to the, or back to the Los Angeles Rams. I could see the Raiders taking a chance. It depends on what the Raiders do with uh, Michael Crabtree. There's talk about, about Gruden and the staff knocking my keyboard over. Gruden and the staff maybe uh, cleaning house a little bit, you know, kind of retooling the team, keeping the core guys, obviously. But um, oh yeah, is that what Karen's redemption will look like? I think so. Although I thought her said relics. No, mirror dual signatures. I think I think these are the mirror dual signatures. Um, I can see Titans. Oh man, send Crabtree to the Seahawks. Richard Sherman and Michael Crabtree at practice every day. Oh, that would be great. I'd like to see that. I'm sure they're fine. Just heat, of, heat of the moment. I'll bet it's one of those kids. I'll bet they have like the same agent or something like that. And so they're probably buddies. <laughs> I don't I don't think the Raiders I don't, the, I don't think the Raiders or and the Broncos would ever do a trade for Crabtree. Uh Watkins though. I don't think, yeah, I don't think Steve, Steve and the Broncos don't want it. Yeah, I don't think you're in this one, Steve. This is uh This is break ten. Pick your team ten for illusions. Um Sammy Watkins. Titans, Titans could be a good fit. There's Kevin King, long live the King. Five out of 50 for the Packers, that'll be for Tyrone. Here's a big one, where does Jarvis Landry go? NFL.com is suggesting potential fits as the Baltimore Ravens and Cleveland Browns. There's Wayne Gallman, First Impressions Relic for the Giants. That'll be for Karen. Another redemption coming up. Maybe a target for Sammy Watts. going to be a target for Mariota. Um, Jarvis Lange to the Ravens? There's Taiwan Taylor, first impressions, Patch Auto. He's got a nice autograph. Taiwan Taylor for the Titans DVD. And that one. There you go, Dustin. Ravens. Actually, the Jarvis Landry on the Ravens kind of sounds like a good fit. I feel like I feel like he's a very Ravensy kind of receiver. I like Landry though. Not 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 like a, a super sexy receiver, you know what I mean? But but is very consistent. Four out of twenty-five, and great at what he does, you know. Nice dual relic. Four out of twenty-five. Alvin Kamara and Michael Vick. That's pretty cool. We got a few. We got a handful of randomizers to take care of. 
We got Jabril Peppers out of 100. This spicy hit goes to Tyler and last spot mojo. Folks, 70% of the time, last spot mojo hits 100% of the time. There you go, Tyler. Steve Freeze, when are they going to bring back this old Denver Broncos logo? Do they use that anymore? The one in your, the one as your avatar in, in the uh, in the chat. I should bring back back that logo. That's a nice logo. Maybe they have a throwback jersey day. You're welcome, Tyler. Maybe they have a throwback jersey day where they use that. Lakers are going to win this game. They were leading. Oh, they, they don't even use it for like a throwback game? I thought they would at least bring it back for some sort of throwback jersey day. No? I think they, I think they should bring it back. Yeah, Lakers are down by a little bit. Um, I think these are all... Who are the other big free agents that are out there? Well, Drew Brees, I think, is technically a free agent, right? Drew Brees, free agent? Where does he go? Oh, yeah, AJ McCarron will, did win it. Rick Hunt said that a little bit earlier. AJ McCarron won, won his grievance, will become a free agent. Oh, I spoke too soon. John Gruden saying he envisions Beast Mode and Crabtree to return. To return. And Joe Thomas lobbying Kirk Cousins to consider the Browns. Which would actually not be a, wouldn't be a bad fit, I think. Alright, good luck everybody. Second to last box. We've got D.D. Westbrook. 73 out of 100. Two color patch for the Jaguars. And Mark Glassman. Nice Mark. We got Spotlight Relic, Andrew Luck, 18 out of 100. Brian Crouch with the Colts. How does everyone feel about Andrew Luck? Is he going to be healthy? He's going to be healthy ever? That's the concern. That's the worry. There's Von Miller. And we've got first impressions, two color patch and autograph, 28 out of 50 are Darius Stewart. That goes to the Jets and Michael Gallucci. With the Jets, Jets, Jets. Next autograph is Gerald Everett for the Rams, 53 out of 100. Feel free to use the entire canvas there, Gerald Everett. Just saying, Gerald. Uh, that rookie auto goes to Vic and the Rams. Got some points coming up. That'll be randomized to one person in the break. If there's any more points, it'll be a winner take all. Winner take all on the points. Uh, what's up, Dave? I, we've not seen any Cardinals as of yet. I don't remember any. But maybe in the last box. And I gotta get I gotta get Sam some chargers here for some for some birthday mojo for him. Alright, good luck everybody. Thanks for filling. Oh, and we'll pop open all those uh, box toppers too all at once at the end. You never know, there could be an auto in there too. Alright, good luck everyone. Still got a box left, Dave. Uh, Tyler wants, uh, he wants to see a Kaiser, a Kaiser roll, a Deshaun Kaiser roll. Let's see what we got. Good luck, everyone.
morning. Good luck, everybody. Redemption. Wow. Sweet Kareems are made of these. First impressions, memorabilia, autograph, red. Red. Let's go to CardboardConnection.com. Let's look up what that red parallel is all about. I don't know what that's number two. Out of 10, maybe? First impressions, memorabilia autographs. Red. Red is out of 50. Nice. Chiefs, Ryan. There you go. Royal for speed, sweet Kareems are made of these, nice. There's the red right there. Nice hit. Got a dual relic, both giants. 38 out of 100, Davis Webb, Eli Manning. We have a couple Giants fans in here who have been saying that that I think the Giants are kind of all in on Davis Webb, so they may be looking to to retool other parts of their team. I mean, they'll have Eli Manning go this year for as long as he can, but after that, we got Devonte Mays, 86 out of 100. Go Pack, go for Tyrone. We've got Rookie Reflection. We've got a nice, some nice randomizers coming up. Five out of 10, Mitch Trubisky and my homies, Patrick Mahomes, Rookie Reflection. Nice color in there. And uh, two promising quarterbacks. We'll see how they progress next season. Randomizer. Is that it? Maybe, I think so. I think that might be it, folks. Oh, we got one more. Raekwon McMillan for the Wu-Tang Clan, 109 out of 250. Raekwon going to Curtis Erickson. There you go, Curtis. And that is that, folks. All right, let's see what's in those box toppers. We had eight boxes. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Perfect. I didn't accidentally throw one away. This was my fear. So they're on the bottom. All right. First one is 41 out of 50, Devontae Adams for the Go Pack Go. Going to the guy that actually suggested that we should save the box toppers. Next up is Dangerous and Jim Zorn in the background. One out of 150 for the Seahawks. Donald Brazier. Next one, we have out of 25, Adrian Peterson and Ricky Williams. That goes to the Saints, that'll be for Karen. Karen Steele with that one. Happy birthday to Karen. We need to find some birthday mojo for Sam. We still. We still have some of these cards to go, Sam. I'm hoping. Won't be this one, though. This one is Matt Stafford. 58 out of 100, Matthew Stafford and Bobby Lane in the back. There you go. Lions, that goes to Matthew Long. We have some Patriots for Karen. One out of 25, Danny Amendola and Dion Branch. Yes, they are pretty pretty similar. All right, three more to go. Good luck, everyone. We have Vaughn Miller, Steve Atwater in the back. Thirteen out of one hundred. Broncos. Oppo. Joe Mojo going to Karen. Nice, Karen. Happy birthday. And this one is. 
Le'Veon Bell and the bus Jerome Bettis, 23 out of 25. Nice low number for Scott and the Steelers. And last but not least, good luck. We have Matty Ice and Michael Vick, 40 out of 50. I don't know if I don't know if Matt Ryan has the legs like Michael Vick though. They both got good arms though. All right, those are your encased cards, and we've got a lot of randomizers to do. Don't worry, Sam. We still have break credit left. That could be some of that birthday mojo. All right. Left, right, randomizer. And then number three, third on the list, we'll get 150 points. Let's see. We'll save. We'll hit the train whistle there. That one there. That one there. And that one there. All right. Let's go to random.org. Where's random.org? There's random.org. There it is. Let's go to random.org. Let's get some dice. Let's get one, two, three, four, five, six lists. One, two, three, four, five, and six. We'll go left, right, randomizer. There was a triple relic that featured uh, the, those uh, defensive guys, Von Miller, Broncos. Julio Mack, Raiders, and then Joey Bosa, Chargers. So you're, you're in on this one, Sam. We've got the dual relic, Alvin Kamara and Michael Vick, which I thought was pretty cool. Saints and Falcons edition of Michael Vick. Next up was the rookie reflections out of 10, Mitch Trubisky, Bears. My homies, Patrick Mahomes, Chiefs. And then we got the train whistle, the uh, the out of five, four out of five triple relic. Troy Aikman, Joe Namath, Kurt Warner. And of course, everybody gets a shot at the break credit. So let's get everyone, everyone's name from David down to Andrew. And the name on top will get 25 bucks of break credit. The second name will get 10 bucks of break credit, a little extra bonus. And the third person will get 150 points. And we'll use one dice roll for all of the lists. It's going to be two and a one, three easy times. Three easy times. Good luck, everybody. Left, right. One, two, three. Easy. Left side. We'll get those. All right, there's all the teams on the left. We'll get those. Next up, three easy times for the Broncos, Raiders, Chargers. One, two, three. And three stays with the uh, goes to the Raiders. Johnny with the Raiders. Eleven out of fifty on this triple relic. Next up, four out of twenty-five. Michael Vick, Alvin Kamara, three times. One, two, and three times. Falcons with that one. That'll be Tim H with the Dirty Birds. Four out of twenty-five. Kamara and Michael Vick dual relic. This is actually pretty cool. Oh, nice, nice. To the two quarterbacks to 10. Once again, two and a one, three times. One, two, and three. Chiefs. That goes to Ryan, Royal Force Speed. Nice one, Ryan. Got the got the uh, hunt. And now has my homies. Five out of 10, Mitch Trubisky and Patrick Mahomes. And the train whistle. Two and a one, three times for the train whistle. Cowboys, Jets, Rams. One, two, and three. Rams with that one. The Ramily. That is for Vic and the Rams. There you go. Troy Aikman, Joe Namath, and Kurt Warner. Four out of five. Los Angeles Rams. Vic, all aboard. The Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. And the extra bonuses for everyone. Good luck. Everyone's name is in three times. One. Two and three. The names on top are Mark Glassman, 25 bucks of break credit coming your way. Curtis Erickson, 10 bucks of break credit coming your way. And Michael Gallucci, 150 points coming your way. Thanks very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. There's our website right there. Check back there for more football, basketball, baseball, soccer. This was our, you won't find illusions, though. This was our last break of illusions. Pick your team 10. Thanks very much, everyone. We'll break with you next time. Bye-bye.